Hello everybody out there in the YouTube world. Thank you for following for uh, finding this video and watching with me today. Anyways, um I am gonna have to apologize to you guys beforehand for it because it's gonna be another one of those um YouTube videos that I am actually just gonna be walking around just talking, kinda like a vlog. But I'm trying I'm trying to stay positive about what's going on with the whole Carrie Fisher death and I know that has affected a lot of people out there. But um if any of you watch Justin Scard's um, YouTube channel, you'll know that he says that he's on a quest for positivity. That's kind of, I kind of adopt, adopted that same concept after I heard him say that. I want to, I'm trying to keep this YouTube channel po as positive as I possibly can. Steer away from negativity, you know, report good things. I mean, I'm not saying that the whole Carrie Fisher death was a good thing. But is that she was a cultural icon as Princess Leia in Star Wars. Um, I just think it's a good thing to be able to help remember her. Everything she's done. But there's one thing right now that I'm irritated by. My last video, if you've watched it. It was a video of me announcing, well, announcing that Carrie Fisher had passed away. Um... Got over a little over 100 views, about 150 views as of right now, as of the last time I checked, about 10 minutes ago. Um, she died today, this morning. Yes, today is December 27th, but I probably won't be able to post this until December 28th, tomorrow morning. My wife is using my laptop right now, so I can't get on there. I can't upload the video I'm using my GoPro for. But there was one, there was one notification that irritated me so much, one comment that irritated me that I had to block the user from actually being able to view my future videos. And that's something that I do not want to have to do. Um, anyways, what had happened is the no I got the notification on my phone saying so-and-so left this comment, see what she says, stuff like that, he or she says. So I opened up the notification on my YouTube app on my phone but it brought me to the, it actually brought me to the video when I, and when I scrolled down to the comment section to see what people are saying, there was nothing that actually showed up, which is weird. And I went back to the notification section and it was there, but part of the message, I didn't, I didn't, I was not able to see part of the message. And I, so what I did is I went ahead and I took a screenshot of it and here's an actual copy of the screenshot I'm about to present to you right now. I want you guys to go ahead and read it. I'll leave it on for a few seconds. It's not going to be on for very long. So if you want to be able to read what was on there, then go ahead and pause the video right when it comes up and read it. I'll be back here in a few seconds. Anyways, as you can see, that sounded like it was something that was very anti-Christian. I guess you can say and if you have been if you have been following my channel for a while you will know that I live here in the state of Utah um, I live about 45 minutes south of Salt Lake City and you guys you probably know you guys can probably tell what I'm trying to get at yes I am a Mormon I do consider myself a Christian because Christians are believers in Jesus Christ and heavenly and our Heavenly Father it says so in the, in the official church name the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints um, I know this is not a video I'm trying to promote my religion right now. Um, I'm not trying to shove my religion down the throat is what I meant by that. But I, I was really offended by that comment that that user left. Um, because I, just because I believe, believe in God. Um, the reason why I got offended by it is because I do have a belief in God and I do not go around saying that um, if you don't believe in God you're going to be shunned or you know sent to hell and stuff like that. I don't think I don't think that way. I mean, I want to if you're interested in our religious beliefs, my belief system, then you can ask me about it and I'd be more than willing to talk to you about it, but I'm not going to force it down your throats. I'm not going to trying to phrase it the right way. I'm not going to shove it down your throats unless you guys actually have real legitimate questions about it. 
I'd be more than willing to talk about it. Otherwise, I won't really say much about it. But saying that, telling me that I should renounce my God, quote unquote, my God, is to me, it's the same God that every other Christian religion believes in. Same God. I'm not going to renounce my belief in God because a celebrity had passed away. And I'm sorry if that sounds insensitive. I don't mean it to sound insensitive. I do have a belief that Carrie Fisher in the afterlife will have a chance to live forever in a second in life after death. Um, we in the LDS religion believe that every person who has come and gone will have the chance to listen to hear to the hear the gospel that is taught. Um, and we, that includes Carrie Fisher. Um, to, and I'll agree, there are a lot of people saying that 2016 sucks, that it sucks because of how many celebrities have passed away, you know, there's Prince, Carrie Fisher, um, George Michael, Alan Rickman, you know, a whole bunch, a whole bunch of celebrities passed away this year. And yeah, it sucks, um, but it's not going to be the end of the world because I believe that there is a life after death and they'll have a chance to, you know, be with their families again. But to me, the way the comment was was heading, the direction that the com that comment was heading into me tells me that you know even if you believe in like satanic rituals or whatever whatever the rest of that message was gonna say, um, you do believe that there's also a heaven. There's all, I mean everything has its opposites, good and evil, evil and good and stuff like that. Um, but, like I was saying a little while ago, I'm, the main purpose of this channel is to report about happy things. And I know that death is a hard thing to cope with for a lot of people. And a lot of people might see it as something negative. But I, I don't. Just because, like for example, talking about Carrie Fisher's death or anybody else's death kind of helps preserve their memory. It's kind of like a good historical record for people. Um, so, and, and that's, that's actually what I think of it as, um, living proof of history. Uh, we can be able to always keep these people in our memories and stuff like that. You know what I, you know what I mean? I hope it's not too confusing. And I'm sorry if I'm sounding a little preachy, but I'm not, please don't force your beliefs on me you might a lot of people might have different belief, beliefs where when it comes to religion or politics or whatever which is fine just i don't like being attacked for my beliefs i don't attack other people for their beliefs um but comments like that i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to block that user i mean i would love to have the subscription but if you're going to attack me for my beliefs i'm I'm, I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to hear about it. And I hope I don't offend anybody who says that. But once I hit, read like a negative comment like that, I'm going to block the user. And I'm sorry about that. I'm, 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 I'm going to block that user from viewing my content. And if I say, in my videos, if I say anything offensive, I'm, I'm terribly sorry. There's a lot of things I um, don't understand about other people's beliefs, which is okay. Um, I want to know what people believe. I want to understand people and their psychology better. Um, so yeah, I'm just I'm I'm just a little irritated by that, and I'm sorry that if I that this sounded a little preachy to people. Um, and I hope that I, I did not hurt anybody's feelings. Uh, I'm not gonna do, uh, by saying what I I'm not, I hope I didn't hurt up anybody's feel or hurt anybody's feelings by saying what I said in this video. I'm just stating what I believe in. And I know that people out there will not believe the same things I believe, which is okay. That's the beauty of, of being here in America. We have the right to believe what we want to believe. We have the freedom of religion. Or for some people, freedom from religion. Stuff like that. Um, again, I'm not, you don't have to agree with me. You don't have to listen to what I have to say. But the point is... That last video that I made, the one prior to this, I was just announcing that Carrie Fisher had passed away. I was not looking for any negative comments. or Heck, I wasn't even looking for any positive comments, really. Um, but 
It's just that a lot of people, to a lot of people, Carrie Fisher meant something there. There is a large, vast amount of people who are Star Wars fans. You know, and I was just, I was just trying to, you know, be nice and recognize that. Feel, I mean, you can, uh, you can leave comments on it if you wanted to. Uh, I actually welcome comments, but if you if you want to say something negative or if you just have a question about something you thought you believed or thought we believed or whatever, I'm more than willing to help explain it the best way that I can. Um, anyways, I hope this video didn't bore you guys too much. I know it's a little bit long, but I was just irritated by that one comment. Um, don't forget to like and give a like and a share of this video. Share this video on your on your, on your social media. Comment below. Um, you can also visit my Patreon page, www.patreon.com slash Chris Sarine to help some adventures happen. I'm trying to look for a little bit of extra funding to go out, funding to go out and go be able to, to do these adventures out on the weekends, record them and let you know, bring them to you and let you watch what I do, stuff like that. Um, and then also www.facebook.com slash groups slash famous American stuff. I would like to get, it's a private page. I'd like for people to join and share your photos and your, um, share your photos and your videos of what you're doing on a daily basis. It's kind of a, I know it says American on there, but it's famous for, or America is, was built on immigration basically. So our finding fathers they all came from immigrants themselves a lot of them come from different different parts of the world asia europe australia even africa you know i want to see what your history is what's what's important to you so come join my page share your photos share your videos you can even share links to your youtube channel for more people to come and subscribe to your channel um let's see you can also follow me on twitter at or at chris Sarine. Um, that's more my, you know, kind of, that's kind of more of my page where people can come follow me. I'll post a video. I post links to my videos in there every once in a while. Anyways, I'll go ahead and talk to you guys later. Love you guys. Keep watching. Keep following. Keep uh, sending that, keep sending out links for my channels. Get more people to subscribe. I'm trying to get at least, I'm trying to get a goal of at least 100 subscribers. And right now I'm at 85. So I'm almost there, but let's keep it going. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.